wanted to demonstrate how scorpions glow under a black light. Yep, those are baby scorpions. Yeah, it's a dime for perspective. I'm in my closet showing you this part of it. I'll move out of the closet here. Go in the other room. Show you what I've got going on here. The scorpion fell on my bed, crawling my pants and stung me, crawling my shorts right on my butt crack. Stuck it in a jar with other scorpions that I've caught my house the same way you can see some of my other videos of other scorpions I've caught and what I've done with them but this scorpion was bigger than usual a couple days later voila a bunch of babies on the back so I put it here in this Pyrex container with a dime for perspective to show you guys what baby scorpions look like on their mother's back. And I found out that these babies can and do and will climb glass. See if I can stir them up a little bit. Wake up. Here, I'll zoom in for you. I tried to count these. I'll probably count them a little better later by hitting pause, but I've got all of them off the mama's back and counted. Uh, there's at least 30. I haven't got an exact figure, but that's roughly how many. If you guys can tell me what these things eat, what scorpions eat, Maybe I'll try to keep her alive. It's not focusing on that one. Anyway. We get quite a few scorpions in the house every year. I'm in Austin, Texas. Get over here on your mom. Anyway, I just thought you guys would think this was interesting. I think it's interesting.
they almost kind of look like little maggots. And I don't know how they eat, or if they just live off their fat, or if the mom has some sort of milk, or the mom eats other bugs, and I don't know what. They were born in this jar right here. With several other scorpions. And the mom killed them all. Well, I just figured out one is alive, but there was about five scorpions in there. Now there's only about three and some pieces. Put some paper under it for contrast. Yeah, it's definitely better with the paper. Stir her up, get her walking around, make the video more interesting. I don't know how many of you guys have seen scorpions with babies in tow. I don't know if the babies can sting. I don't know if they hurt worse or less. I guess I'm not really willing to do that experiment. Not on myself anyway. They're pretty clingy little things. Sticking on there pretty good. Pulling a few off there to give you guys an idea. It's June 6th, 2013. So if you guys have any questions or want me to do, do some sort of experiment that somebody like me with limited scientific capabilities can handle, I'll see what I can do. Just leave me a comment or a question and I will, you know, see what we can do. I'll probably have these for you know, depending on how long I can keep them alive. And I guess that depends on your guys' feedback because I have no idea what a scorpion eats, how to keep them alive. All I've done was put them in these jars after I catch them. And I've gotten as many as 20 in the jar before I threw the jar away. So, anyway, there you go. Mama Scorpion. Baby Scorpions. <laughs>